Hello. In this particular question, we are talking about a test which has 50 questions. He can get a question correct or wrong or you may not attempt that particular question. So there are three types of attempting a question that is you can get it correct or you can get it wrong or you can choose not to attempt it. So there are 50 questions. So the number of questions attempted correct plus wrong plus not attempted is going to be 50. As far as your score is concerned, you get one mark for correct, which means so that will be C. You get minus one third for a wrong answer. So minus W by three and you get minus one by six for not attempting. So that is minus N by six. How much did you score or how much did the student score? The student score was 32. So first of all, let me write this equation in some form that I'm a little more comfortable with. Take the LCM as 6. So you'll get 6C minus 2W minus N as 6 into 32. 30 into 6 is 180 plus 12. Or this gives me 192. Now, if you add these two equations, that is this one and this one, what will you get? C plus 6C is 7C. W minus 2W will be minus W, the N and N will minus N will cancel and here you will get 242. So this is the basic information that is given to us. Now the question is asking me the number of questions answered wrongly by that student cannot be less than. So what is the minimum number of questions that he answered wrongly? Now when will that happen as per this equation? Well, when this 7C part goes just above 242, so think of a multiple of 7, which will be just above 242. Now I know 210 is divisible, 7 into 30. Then if I add 35 more, or that becomes 245. So when C is equal to 35, my total score or total 7C would be 245. What will have to be W in that case? W in that case has to be 3 and that is our answer because you cannot get a value of W which can be less than 3. That's just not possible. So our answer for this particular question is 3. Thank you.